hey 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 today is an exciting day why because it's travel day welcome to my channel fly for 44 all things travel what is fly first love you yes today is my 201 post for my 254 day challenge glory to god glory to god just so thankful that i was able to be in the land of the living this morning i had an early morning flight which i did not miss glory to god i was i was a little bit nervous as um i had in my mind that i would be at the airport at four but I was still at home at 4.30. And my flight started boarding at 5.45. But thankful as always. Life is rigged in my favor. And it was helpful that today was Monday. Very light travels. So I actually made my gate with minutes to spare even having to check my luggage glory to God so I flew on over funny because I was watching the price of the flights and trying to get that low ticket I really I missed having a layover y'all know I don't like doing them layovers but it actually wasn't bad it seemed like it shortened the time so it took me an hour and 10 minutes to fly from Detroit to Nashville Tennessee I had an hour layover in Nashville which I was able to grab me some breakfast and um, ate my breakfast and then was able to reboard and the second flight was like an hour and 48 minutes so Today was a um, very uh, relaxed uh, movement. No worries, no rushes. Spring break is coming to an end again. Today was definitely a great day to travel. And that breakfast was uh, amazing. I'm trying to think of the name of the place. I will put it in the description once I get it in my mind on what it was. Southwest Airlines. I actually love the flight that I was on this morning. I think it seemed like we might have been on a, that first plane. seemed like it was a new plane. Everything was light and bright and sparkling. So, I'm off on a four-day vacay solo travel solo cruising i made it to miami port of miami and i boarded the msc cruises the ship divina a bit smaller than seashore we were on back in <laughs> september an absolutely ladies and gentlemen beautiful i'm like Thank you. Oh, uh, trip should take approximately 15 minutes, barring traffic. 
But you know, this is Miami, so who knows? So I'm about to visit deck 18. I thought should have been going up. <laughs> This is the area for the MSC Yacht Club. You must be a member to access this area. It costs a little bit more and it's just think of VIP and Butler 24-7. Separate eating areas, separate viewing, separate pools, separate jacuzzis, VIP. But today's ship is the, um, I actually saw that they, they said that the ship was actually full um, to capacity, but mm, I think they just posted that. It can't be. Not the way that that line looked coming in. It actually was no line. So, nowhere near. <laughs> I'm not believing that we have full capacity on this ship. It's some areas where it's congested, but then there's other areas where it's completely empty. So, no. I'm not going to believe that. Even with the MSC yacht part of it. I was over on that side without my credentials even yeah, being checked so agent, so i like to oh, get out stay even tuned. if no one else comes <laughs> i work with expedia.com okay okay by the way have you checked the uh black bird check for it now we have the restaurant for you guys oh no i'm 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 starting this is the top right floor now. 18 right so uh, in here we have you have two options for breakfast and lunch mm -hmm. the one on the other side mm -hmm. so you can take here if you don't want to go to the back of the ship that's where your restaurant is it's in deck 15. Okay. So okay. you can check the menu if you don't want to go there right now. We have in deck 15 also in Topsy Lounge. We have the list of menu over there. Okay. All right. Thank you. Terrible. I'm assuming he thought I was a Yacht Club member, but one day I will be this trip. Well, this cruise <clears throat> actually cost me $206 with my travel agent rate so technically if someone would have opted um, in to come with me then it would have been 103 for me and 103 for them but if you know me you know i don't like to share my room i don't like to share my room so unless it's a dude <laughs> Just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. Hold on, let me hear what they're saying. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, all guests who have not gone to your assembly station, please proceed to your assembly station immediately in order for us to continue with the next part of our safety demonstration. Once again, all guests who have not gone to your assembly station, please proceed to your assembly station immediately in order for us to continue with the next part of our safety demonstration. Thank you. raining I'm aboard the MSC Davina a lot different from the MSC seashore I have to go back and visit for I was totally distracted on that seven day cruise. Only got a good four out of the seven. 
three of the days I shut down after realizing I was traveling with an op. I was being played the fool, being used. One moment, hold on, let them finish here with their one second, you guys, hold on. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of our captain, Captain Piotr Borosinski, the safety demonstration has been completed. We inform you that the ship's medical facility is located on deck four midship, and in the event of a medical emergency, please dial 115. Also, we would like to remind you that during the emergency demonstration, the luggage distribution service was suspended. The distribution of luggage will resume shortly, and your luggage should arrive. Well, it's looking like we'll be ready to disembark shortly, and I am so looking forward to it. First stop is NASA. I believe we'll arrive in NASA, Bahamas at 8, 7 or 8 tomorrow morning. And we're due to disembark from there, I believe about 5 p.m. Headed to Ocean K, where we'll actually be there overnight. Two days and overnight. And then we'll be headed back home, arriving back in Miami. When you're excited about your vacay, looking forward to the cruise on embarkment day. Thought you was gonna get in your little two-piece, but it's it's raining. It's raining. But I'm still gonna have an amazing four day vacation. I'm going to charge my phone. We're not leaving, I think, until about 7 o'clock. And it's 2, so we got like 5 hours. I got to charge my phone. And then I'm going to take y'all on a little tour like Lee Loda. <laughs> Leah, whatever his name is. Like he does. Like Exactly. And then, you know what? I'm going to go up a little bit further and see what's up here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I wanted to go up there. Now I got to learn what my room is.
Davina, Davina, this is my cabin. I have a balcony suite. Um, On seashore, I had a bathtub, but no bathtub in this one, but it's cool. I didn't use the bathtub there, no way. It just made it a little bit more growing here, but this is cool. It's just me. Space for closet. Look like four people can actually sleep here because that couch lets out into a bed. I don't know about the space for clothes, though. Lloyd go. Hello. Lloyd. Lloyd. This ship is much smaller than an MSC Seashore, but it's still huge. I looked um, at a list not too long ago, and I think MSC was like number seven or eight on the list for the top uh, cruise liner ships. I'm like, wow, okay. Looks like I haven't seen nothing yet. Just getting started. But it's the stairs for me. And I brought a dress that's gonna glitter, shimmer. Ooh, we am so excited. Forward to, hey, can even bowl. It's just so much. I love this life. Cruising is my niche. And if you're a solo cruiser or a solo traveler, cruising, hmm, might want to look into. You can hit several destinations. 
and one vacay. If you haven't cruised, what are you waiting for? We have a world to explore and a number of ships and a number of different cruise liners. So, I wonder what would be your best or your favorite. Right now, mine is the MSC Italian Cruise Liner. Yes. I'm stuck on MSC right now. They have some really nice spots where you can just go sit and chill. It's like the decor is welcoming, inviting, warm, and rich. I just love it. That was the last ship I, I was it, on back in January. It. I was over there looking over here. Now I'm over here looking over there. <laughs> Getting ready to race to NASA. We'll see them in NASA. Actually, we still got another hour before we leave. Bye! <laughs> so long! But hey, while you're here today, click subscribe, click like, or thumbs up. Welcome to my channel.